Hi there, I'm Dr. Jim. I have an interesting topic for you today. The science behind positive leadership. Yes, there's a science behind it. Culture change has been a buzzword, a buzz concept, if you will, in businesses of all types and for quite a while. One of the most important ingredients in culture change is positive leadership. While this might seem obvious, there's actually a science behind positive leadership and how powerful and influential it could be in any workplace. According to research performed by the Heart Math Institute, they show that when an individual has a feeling in their heart, whether it's positive or negative, that feeling travels to every cell in the body and then outwards to other people. Now, I call that energy. A team of researchers in the 1990s discovered that such feelings can be felt by people up to 10 feet away. This is a real thing. This is a real energy. People literally feel what one's heart is expressing and in real time. Leadership must take this concept seriously because each and every day they broadcast what their heart is feeling to their staff and others that they come into contact with. Researchers from Harvard University also found that emotions can be contagious and affect others in positive or negative ways. Leaders then can affect a lot of people throughout their or through their attitudes, their energy, their emotions, and their behaviors. You just don't know how many people you affect a day. So what kind of energy should leaders transmit to their employees? Regardless of the situation or the circumstances, leaders should broadcast very specific types of energy to their team. Positivity, love, compassion, and purpose are the types of emotions from the leader's heart that will uplift the workplace, motivate employees, and drive success. Words, as you know, are important. Emotions and energy may be even more influential when it comes to being a positive leader. If leaders want to seriously change their workplace or their corporate culture, it must begin with them. Leading with a positive heart seems like a great place to start. I'm Dr. Jim, and this has been the science behind positive leadership. Keep coming back for more.